welcome to USANA Kids Eat and the headquarters of the USANA Foundation. We are so glad that you're here. Volunteers like you are the heart of our program. Before we put you to work, we'd like to tell you a little about our program and give you some training. Sometimes when people hear the word USANA, they think of the USANA Amphitheater and concerts. <laughs> and while we do sponsor the amphitheater, we are actually a worldwide health and nutrition company. That global perspective has helped us see the need and deprivation that exists out there. So the USANA Foundation was created to provide nutrition to the most vulnerable all over the world. We focus on immediate food needs and we work with communities to create self-reliance and end malnutrition for good. After years of providing global relief, we discovered that there's also great need right here in our own backyard. We wanted to make an impact here in Utah by feeding kids who are food insufficient at home. One of the best ways to identify these kids in need and get them some help is to work through local clubs and schools. So we brought some awesome local programs under our umbrella and opened our doors in December of 2019, serving 63 schools right out the gate, sending over 800 kids home with food every single weekend and providing 3,500 kids with food for the holidays. We were able to keep our work going throughout the pandemic and we continue to grow, serving over 5,000 hungry kids today. We've got plenty of schools on our waiting list who need our help. And as you're about to see, hunger is very real in Utah. Listen up, Utah. We got a problem. When I get hungry, I can get a little cranky. <sighs> Not cool. And a lot of kids in Utah have it way worse than me. And that's why USANA Kids Eat needs you. USANA Kids Eat packs over 800 backpacks with 5,600 meals that are delivered to kids every weekend. They have all sorts of yummy stuff that help kids learn, grow, and just be kids. <laughs> Donate to USANA Kids Eat or come and volunteer to pack a bunch more backpacks and help a lot more kids. Maybe you think you're too busy to volunteer. I'm not buying it. Let's work together to give hungry kids in Utah food so they grow up big and strong. They need food. They need you. Make a donation or pack a backpack and change a kid's life. It's really easy. Listen up, Utah. No child should ever go hungry. If one in nine sounds like a lot, it's because it is. This number is high because these kids are found in all areas. In fact, hungry kids in more affluent areas tend to be more embarrassed to accept help and they often fall through the cracks. So not only do we serve the kids from the Title I schools, but we try to catch the smaller groups from wealthier areas who are in need too. Thanks to teachers who know the kids and their situations, the ones who need the most help can be identified. We deliver these bags of food to the schools throughout the week, and then the schools on Friday discreetly distribute these to the kids. It's the easiest way to get nutrition to those kids. We never need to know the names of the kids, and this preserves their privacy. Sometimes there's a child who's embarrassed about their situation and afraid to take a bag. We remedy this by packing into black bags that are unmarked, and that way no one knows but the child that there's food inside. But these kids are tough. Some of these families have experienced job loss, they've had a parent pass away, or they have a family member who's very sick. And sometimes these kids are dealing with scary things in their home, such as drug use, neglect, abuse, and violence. On top of the stress that comes from their home situation, they're going to school, they're dealing with peer pressure, they're taking tests and doing their homework, just like everybody else. But many times, they're doing it on their own. As you're about to see, there's a lot of food in these weekend bags. And it's because we're fueling not just their bodies, but also their minds. And it's more than food. It reminds them that they're not alone. They know that we believe in them and we've got their back. One of the amazing things about being part of USANA is that they cover our administrative costs, like our building and the wages for our full-time employees. What that means is when you donate, your donation pays for food for kids. Our school adoption program lets sponsors, which could be individuals, families, or companies, 
choose to fund a specific school for an entire year. They have the option to come in and pack those bags, and it's awesome to see how these sponsors really take a whole school under their wing and the amazing connection that it creates. And anyone can donate, any amount, any time through our website. So please spread the word. Even with USANA Health Sciences backing us, we rely on the donations to pay for the food and other resources that are needed to distribute it. And we rely on you, our epic volunteers. No matter how much food we have here in this building, without you, it can't get to the kids. Thank you so much for being here. Now, let's get you trained on the pack line. Hi everybody, I'm so glad you found the time to volunteer with us. Feeding kids in Utah is a huge job, and it's super important we get it right. So let's get down to business. The first thing you should know about these bags is that kids love them. Kind of like how they love their favorite stuffed animal. Phew, that was close. Hey! You get the picture. That's why it's so important to pack these bags the right way. Here's how you do it. Put the heavy stuff on the bottom, the squishy stuff in the middle, and the stuff that can break on top. It's super easy. Just follow the signs above the food. That way the bag stays right side up and the food stays in one piece. It's not rocket science. The last thing you should know is that we need lots of bags. And not just this week, but every week. So before you hand that perfectly packed bag off to the Kids Eat staff, snap a selfie and tag us at USANA Kids Eat to help us spread the word. Thank you for taking the time to make sure no child ever goes hungry. <laughs>